Python is a free, open-source programming language that has a heavy focus on code readability and indentation. It is accessible and modifiable, and can be used to design and customize web applications for scientific computations, artificial intelligence, and data science. It is an interpreted language, so when you run Python code, it is automatically converted into machine language. This is unlike other languages, like C++, which need to be first compiled and then interpreted. Python is easy to learn, code, run, and read, making it a high-demand skill to possess. All of this makes Python the easiest, most used programming language in tech, including in cybersecurity. How Python is used by cybersecurity analysts. In cybersecurity, Python is used to automate processes, write scripts, customize tools, automate and orchestrate security response operations. A cybersecurity analyst uses Python scripts to automate tasks, such as implementing penetration testing. Top 14 Python Libraries for Cybersecurity NLTK, NumberPy, and Pandas are the most Python libraries widely used for natural language processing, data analysis, visualization, and malware analysis. The Scikit library is widely used for implementing machine learning in cybersecurity operations. Machine learning algorithms are also supported by Scikit. Network security-related libraries, like Nmap and Twisted, are widely used for scanning and implementing transport layer, application layer protocols. Scapy is used for packet processing, decoding packets, forging packets, and analyzing the packet information on a network. Beautiful Soup is widely used for scraping data from web pages in the form of HTML and XML. Cryptography library is used in order to implement cryptographic algorithms, specifically for the purpose of securing something, such as a file or a communication. Yara is widely used for malware identification and malware classification. PyMetasploit 3 is a library where you can use the Metasploit framework for discovering hidden vulnerabilities. Mechanize is used for data acquisition, getting data from the web pages, checking SQL injection, and cross-site scripting. Socket library is widely used for socket programming, port scanning, and network sniffing. Requests library is used for API calling and graping HTML web pages. How is Python used in penetration testing? Pen testing is a wide area of implementation where cybersecurity professionals are trying to assess an organization's security. Someone performing a pen test is performing whatever an attacker would do. There are seven stages of penetration testing, and at every stage there are a variety of Python libraries that can be used. Stage 1. Pre-engagement. A cybersecurity team determines the objectives and logistics of the pen test. Stage 2. Information Gathering Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, Nmap, Twisted, Beautiful Soup, Scapy, Socket, Mechanize, and Deployed Script. Stage 3. Threat Modeling Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, PYTM Framework, and Threat Modeling. Stage 4, Vulnerability Scanning Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, Vulners, Safety, and Scapy. Stage 5, Exploitation Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, Pymetaploit 3, Scapy, Socket, and BYOB. Stage 6, Post-Exploitation Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, Pymetaploit 3, BYOB, and RSPET. Stage 7, Reporting. Pen testers rely on the Python libraries, Sys, Plotly, Pandas, and NLTK. How do cybersecurity analysts use Python during a cyber attack? There are a few Python libraries and frameworks that cybersecurity experts rely on when under a cyber attack. PS List. PS list can be used to list processes and identify when certain processes start and how they end. 
PS Tree. PS Tree is used to analyze what processes are running with the help of a tree architecture. PS Scan. PS Scan helps to uncover terminated processes which have already stopped. PSX View. PSX View gives a comprehensive view of processes, their locations, where they are present and in what particular locations in your operating system. GRR, Google Rapid Response, is an incident response framework based out of Python. 